I was initially drawn to management because I, I like figuring out the puzzle that, that people are. And I like trying to figure out what is, it, what is it that motivates them. And understanding motivators is really important to management. And understanding what motivates people and demonstrating that, that benefit to them so that they are motivated to take on an initiative or complete a project or, or just complete a task is really a critical part of, of management. It wasn't until uh, a few years ago that I really, I really discovered that motivation isn't always about demonstrating a benefit. And in order to really understand how to motivate people, you need to understand what is the benefit to them, as well as whether or not they're capable of delivering on the task. And so this, this really came to light uh, a few years ago when we put someone who was incredibly ambitious into a, a position. They wanted to see the company succeed. They'd been, they'd been successful in, in previous roles, and we put them into a position that we thought was, was really fitting this person. And for hours and days and weeks and months, I spent demonstrating the benefit to this person of delivering on, on what we expected of them and uh, the projects and the initiatives and everything that I got, all this, the, the things that were submitted, the documents and, and the, the pieces of, of the project just seemed under par. It seemed like the person wasn't even trying. And when I received these emails, when I received these documents, I'd go back and I'd, I'd consult with the person again and really try to detect what was their motivation. Did they understand the benefit to them? Did they understand the importance of this? And then uh, come back and, and revisit it only to be disappointed a week or two weeks later with the same level of documents, the same level of, of uh, contribution. And it wasn't until then that I, I was talking with someone about this and uh, outside of work and they, they brought it to my attention that this person might not be capable. And this was a, a really, a light bulb went off and it was, it was really something that I, I hadn't considered because I, I thought the person had been successful in the past. They'd been in a, a role uh, where they'd excelled and now in this new position of course they were going to continue that that success and uh, it wasn't until I started digging down and had a conversation with this person the following week that it became apparent that they weren't able to deliver and this person I don't know what I was expecting if they, if they were going to put their hand up and say I, I don't know how to do this I'm incapable of doing this if, if you're waiting around for a person to put their hand up it's, it's probably not going to happen so I'm really in order to motivate someone you need to understand both elements you need to understand that they clearly understand the benefit to them of completing the project, and number two, and probably more importantly, that they're capable.